guys and welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be unboxing the witch's moon for october 2020 so stay tuned like i said i got my box in the mail i'm so excited this is my favorite box of the whole month so this box is $54. It's actually like $53.99, but we'll just round it up and say it's $54. But I cannot wait, wait to get into this. So let's open it up. So when you open it up, okay, everything always falls on me. So I'm trying and oh, hop there. <laughs> Every time I tell you, and I really did try. But anyways, this is what it looks like when you open it up. So we'll pick up the stuff that fell. So the first thing we always get is a Oracle card. And this one is called Moving Forward, right there. Man, the, this, these boxes are like just tuned to me. I don't understand what's going on. But this says the first step is taking within our stillness. So I love this. And we always get, you know, the paperwork that lets us know everything that's in the box and what this box is about. And this box is about Hectate, the Keeper of Keys. Yes. And you can see it right there very excited for that the next thing i see is the keeper of keys and this is a spell right here and i always put these in my grimoire because they're always good for for you know your future reference and they're just so beautiful why wouldn't you want to put them in there so very excited about that and the next thing i see i put these in my grimoire as well and this just talks about um hectate right there and the artwork on this is always so gorgeous. I absolutely love it. So let's get into this box. I'm so excited. So when you get the box, it looks like this. So let's do a little open up. Ooh, there's lots of stuff in there. So let's see, let's see. So the first thing I see are some herbs. So we have Yerba Santa. I hope that's how you say it. Right there. And then we have dandelion root right there. And this looks like poppy seeds right there. I absolutely love their herbs. I collect them every month and it just makes my, you know, my herb collection just grow. It's huge and I love it. So let's see what's next. The next thing we have looks like our incense for the month. And this one is a hectate right there. You can see all the little tidbits in it too. That is so cool. I love their oils. They are definitely one of my favorite. I have such a collection of these as well as like, it seems like everything else I have. So very happy about that. And the next thing I see is some crossroad salt. That seems familiar. I think we've gotten this before. Maybe not. Let's see if I can find. So we, it says, um, this salt has the intention of providing you the time to ponder the many roads that stand before you on the sacred crossroad. During these deeply relative times, it's important for you to be honest with yourself regarding your past, your current situation, and where your path may lead. So that's cool. The last time I tried to open one of these away, I landed it all over my desk. But that is what it looks like right there. It's got lots of like herbs and stuff in it. And this also has dandelion, lavender, mugwort, and chamomile in it as well. So I love these cells. I have such a collection of these in my bathroom. I think I said that about everything now. I have such a collection of everything. <laughs> but that's what happens when you keep getting these boxes. You just keep collecting everything. So there ain't nothing wrong with that at all. So let's see what's next. Next we have a stone. And this is a tourmaline right here. It looks like another tumbled stone. That's pretty. And let's see, um, let's see. This is to protect you on your deep journey this season for a new practitioner. The stone can be very helpful protecting you from any attachments that may want to prey on those who have any doubts. Keep the stone close during rituals where you may inviting guidance into your life. So that is awesome. I love their stones. And then next we have some incense. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And this is, uh, let's see of torches ash right there and next is our candle right here and it looks like a blue candle you always take these up so long. i have such a hard time getting into them oh it's cute it's pretty oh, 
Oh, it's even better. It's even more pretty. Oh, this is gorgeous. So it's blue and purple and look at the key on it. Isn't that awesome? So let's see. So this candle is to honor Hecate, surrounded by the essence of magic. This very special candle is for you to burn during the darkness of nights while calling upon Hectate for guidance or to simply provide gratitude for her protection during your ongoing search of knowledge and understanding. Place upon the candle sits a key. We would kindly recommend moving, removing the key, placing it near the candle as it burns. You don't want to get, it'll get ruined. This token resembles the key, he, the sacred key that Hectite holds, only available for those who may be worthy of accepting wisdom. This token resembles the sacred keys that Hectite holds, only available for those that may be worthy of accepting wisdom from beyond the veil. After you've burned throughout this candle, place the key within your Hectic box as a symbol of recognition. So that is awesome. Box, box. Oh, ooh, what's next? The key just fell. It doesn't want me to have it. So I'm looking forward to see what's next because it gave a little clue. So let's see, let's see. So like I said, there's there's two things left right now. So the first thing I see is this, and it's heavy. What is this? What is this? So <laughs> wow look at oh my gosh look at that that is absolutely absolutely gorgeous this, this is the triple goddess gold cast bronze box so there's one piece so the bottom piece yep let's be right here oh my gosh guys look at that that is absolutely gorgeous I mean, it is, it's heavy. This is why I love, love the Witch's Moon so much. You can't get stuff like this anywhere else. Like, I, I don't know where to get stuff like this. It's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, this is like, the quality on this is ridiculous. So, so th this says, we are so thrilled to be able to include such an intricate box providing such deep symbology and meaning during the Samhain season. This is very specific time of year is sacred to those who are connected with the witchcraft in any way or simple intuitive or natural cycles and spirit connections. As we come closer to the last day of October, we start to feel more confident with our ability to connect with our ancestors. Spirits guides are those that are called to walk beside us on our path. So as we commonly write messages, questions, or intuitions on parchment paper and place them in such boxes. During such an important year, we urge you to travel deep within yourself during these darker months, searching for and listening to your guidance that may be passed to you through signs and symbols when you may least expect them. Be willing to hear the call of Hectate. Meet your, meet you during these times and bask yourself within her powerful energies. So that's awesome. It's like you just put messages in the box and things that you want to come true during the year. I. I amazing i don't have anything like this it's absolutely gorgeous so wow so let's go through everything we got to get in the box so we got this box inside the box we got the hectic essential oils we got the crossroads bath salts we got the beautiful candle with the key we got the incense sticks we got the tourmaline stone and we got three herbs and we got the beautiful artwork in your oracle card and i think that's everything so like i said every month this box blows my mind it's just always so amazing and i don't think there's a better box out there so but I hope you guys like this video. I hope you guys will subscribe to my channel and ring the bell so you will be notified every single time that I upload a new video. I hope you guys have a wonderful and a magical day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!